Hi, my name is Avery Turber, and I'm going to go through some common troubleshooting for the Gemstar epidural infusion pump. If the screen is displaying air in line, here's how you'll clear the air. You press silence and then stop. This clears the alarm. Then you'll want to disconnect the tubing from the patient and press and hold the purge button until the air has been cleared. Then you can reconnect the pump to the patient and all you have to do is press the start button to begin the infusion. You know the infusion has begun when the arrows move across the bottom of the screen. When the screen displays check cassette, you'll press the silence key and then the stop key to clear the alarm. You'll want to reinstall the cassette here, which I showed on video one, but a quick summary, press and hold this, pop out the old cassette, reinstall the cassette, and then press start. When the screen displays occlusion, you want to press the silent key, press the stop key, and then check for the source of the occlusion. This could be kink tubing, closed clamps, tubing not behind the guides. If the problem continues, remove and install, remove and reinstall the cassette. Once you've gotten rid of the problem though, you should be able to push start and not have it alarm again. For an empty container, this means the pump has finished giving the medicine. You'll want to push the silence key, push the stop key, which clears the alarm. Then you'll want to change your medication bag. To change a new container, you press change, select container, and then go through and disconnect your old cassette and do put in a new cassette. Then you'll want to put in push start once again. That has been all. I hope these videos have been helpful. Thank you.